Yeah, I'm extremely productive today. I'm doing three videos, and um, right now, um, my networking isn't really functioning properly. Uh, I think it could be a server problem, maybe. But I, I'm pretty sure it's a networking problem. Okay, so um, use this thing about markets. Um, I don't really talk a lot about markets or discuss economics that much as much as I speak about things in a very civic and sociological manner or just I engage in a lot of political philosophies however I noticed that um, in places where there's a very good sense of prosperity Hong Kong, India some parts of South America and in general just uh maybe China too. These places with these high free markets, uh people complain who are sort of leftists about how children and workers are being treated, that they're being exploited. And one of the things I gotta say is uh now with their income they don't really have enough for some of the rudimentary stuff that we can get, like, uh, I remember in the school project a few days ago, we were watching this, uh, it wasn't a school project, it was a class assignment, we were watching this, uh, clip a few months back in, I think, uh, April through June, somewhere around there, where they were showing these, how these kids were being treated, the scanning, the sense what caught my attention was that for they what they earned like an hour to hour basis wasn't enough for a can of Campbell's tomato soup or something like that which uh, we use regularly because it's really cheap it's like about a dollar and two cents even uh, in the grocery store next door where everything's expensive as hell because they're trying to lure in the college kids with the money. And this got me thinking that it doesn't matter how little money you make so long as uh, there's something that'll act relative to that um, issue. Like, um, if you can't afford... Uh, a can of Campbell's tomato soup, then uh, there should be another group that's producing stuff for people of that income disparity, or in regards to people who can't have enough money, who don't have enough money to pay rent. Uh, there's stuff like police buildings around my neighborhood where uh, people actually pay the once and they don't have to pay any rent afterwards and they can live in something that initially costs as much as an apartment rent and then afterwards there's no nothing you can pay for it until a really cheap and it's a really nice place and there's a lot in uh, my neighborhood because I live in a very poor place so they don't expect you to live in apartments like I do where there's a rent system, so they have a police building system where, okay, you can pay a small fee and then, um, you can have that relative to your income disparity. And the same thing can happen in regards to food, transportation, and things like that. If you can't afford these stuff that even the poor people use in our nation as a backdrop and what could happen is that there could be something that's made relative to your income disparity <coughs> <coughs> best of all it could be made by the same group the same uh, level or same division of labor and if you go to something that's functional and get cheaper, 
I'm not saying that um, for your diet, if you can't afford something that costs like about a dollar, because you can only afford something that's like about a dime, uh, that you should like maybe drink some bubbles mixed with corn syrup. No, what I think is that um, you can have something that's a little bit cheaper, more heavily spiced up. Uh, you'll be surprised about how they can calculate these things and make um, very versatile products for very thinned out groups with a lot of demands and a lot of money. But you can kind of guess that this uh, blog that I'm making is a little bit biased uh, because it's biased for a free market. So if you follow me and you're an anarcho socialist, uh, feel free to disregard this video. Um, you can even like it and dislike it and uh, comment saying how I'm a capitalist pig or a free market pig. That would be more accurate. Uh, because I would respect that. I'm just speaking towards one dichotomy here. Trying to support and make theories for that one dichotomy. 